Tom Walker was like most men of his day, middle-aged, moderately successful, and married. It could be said that his life was ordinary and that he was fairly content, but it is a known truth that it takes the extraordinary to lead us into danger or true happiness. Guys. Hold on. Let's take a break. Dude, another one? Tom, if we stop every five minutes, we're never gonna make the top. Yeah, I guess I'm just a little out of shape. Understatement there. Yeah, let's take it easy on him. You guys just, just go on ahead. I'll try and catch up. If I can't, I'll find my way back down. You sure about that? Yeah, I'm ruining your hike. Come on, Pat, let's just go. Yeah, okay, hey, do you want some more water or something? No, this is good, thanks. Okay. I would light you up like a Roman candle. Sorry, man. Sorry. Sorry? Don't say sorry to Beelzebub. Say that shit for JC. Who? Me! Beelzebub! Ah! you're gonna do something. Uh, look, I swear to God Almighty, I won't. I promise, I, I promise. Huh? <laughs> Don't you know any better than to trust those scratch? That's not a scratch, it's a puncture. Scratch? Scratch? and get some water. I won't stick you this time. Cross my heart, I hope you die. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's not water. Well, sure is. 
fresh from the spring. Spring. <laughs> and what are you doing in the middle of the desert? Shouldn't you be in hell? Yeah. Mm, yeah. Yeah. Well, this place is uh, close as home as it gets, is it? What are you doing here? Hiking. Well, it seems like you have uh, straight from the path. I thought I was taking a short path. Uh, they all say that when they come my way. All right, all right, all right, all right. All right come on, come on. Come on. What can I do for you? I'm just lost. Oh, I'm just lost. I'm just fucking lost. Don't lie to me. All right. Look, I can't grant you forgiveness for your sins. That's, that's JC's job. But, uh, I've been known to do favors for certain people from time to time. What kind of favors? Well, you know, personal kind. Like what? Uh, like maybe your wife. Huh. Well, no, come things on. at home haven't been exactly... Oh, did you hear it? What? Uh, look. <laughs> All right, come on. Let me guess, all right? Your wife's a bitch when you wake up in the morning. Yeah? Yeah. Your wife's a bitch when you go to work. Yeah. 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 And your wife's a bitch when you get home at night. Yeah. 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 And she hasn't touched that little thing in over 10 years. It's been 11. Yeah. It was approximate. I don't know what happened. She doesn't do anything. All she does is complain about what I eat. Yeah. She says I don't make enough money for us to be happy. Yeah. Money, huh? It's all about money with her. Yeah. Yeah, money. It's all about money. There you go. You ever heard of the Lost Dutchman? No. Doesn't surprise me. You know, he was a man kind of like you. He just, he did deal with me to find gold in the mountains. Well, he did. But he did keep his end of the bargain. Oh. I guess what I'm trying to say to you is that I can help you with your financial problems and hence your wife. Really? Yeah. I've been guarding this gold for hundreds of years, and I'm willing to portion some of that for your wife. You'd really do that? Yeah. For me? Yeah. Now you go on home and bring that piece of gold with you, okay? Just go ahead. Take it home. Take it home and uh, show your wife. Show the wife. And just don't tell her about me, all right? Tell her about you. No, don't tell her about me. Jesus. Tell Christ. her about the gold. Yeah, no, tell her about the gold and tell her there's more where that came from. Show it to her. Don't tell her where I got it from. Tell her there's more. Yes, and then you bring her back here. And, um, you'll have no more problems. Thank you. There's just one problem. Yeah. I don't know how to get back. You can leave that to old Scratch. Scratch. Oh, yeah, ba ba ba. Hey, come on, let's go. Hmm. Marcy, Marcy, get up. Stop yelling. Look what I found. Oh, you stink. Get up, look. Take a shower. Seriously, Marcy, look. Haven't you ever heard of fool's gold, you fool? It's not fool's gold. Where'd you get it, Tom? I found it in the desert. I'm gonna take this downtown and have it looked at. And if this is some dumbass trick, it'll be the last time anyone's ever heard of Tom Walker. Slow down. Where is it? It's just over there. Can we take a break? He's huffing up. Just 
this up that way. Better be. It was here. It was right here. Here. Right. He was standing right over there, and he said. He who? The gold. The gold was right there. The gold was right there. Was if you brought me out here for nothing, I will strangle you. Where are you going? To find the gold. Go. Hey. Hey. We gotta go get her. You brought the gold, right? Yeah, okay. Fine. What? Nothing, nothing, nothing. Now listen here, you. You just leave the wheeling and dealing to me, your wife, okay? All right, and uh, you just go ahead and go down and get your car, all right? Wheeling and dealing. Yeah, yeah, okay. wheeling and dealing. This is about the gold, right? Yeah, 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 of course, of course. I'll, I'll give her the goods. Shouldn't I stay and carry the gold? Yeah, yeah. Okay, it's fine. She's... But shouldn't I stay and introduce you? Oh. You never met her. Mm -hmm. No, 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 we'll get acquainted just fine. You know, now you, you just go ahead and get well, the getting's good, okay? I promise, no, I swear, I promise. She'll be just fine. Be home before you know it. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Oh yeah, most definitely. All right, toodles. Tom never did see Marcia again. He notified the authorities and they conducted a two-week search. But she was nowhere to be found. At first he was sad about losing her. But after a couple days, he decided it wasn't such a bad thing after all. He was able to eat whatever he wanted and make as little money as he desired. And anyway, he was sure she'd be all right. The devil had promised to take care of her. <laughs>